Welcome to Complexity Made Simple. My name is Paul Allen and the subject of today's video newsletter, well, what we're going to do is we're going to have a look at a software tutorial, this time now using Minitab as our software of choice. Hope you enjoy it. Okay, welcome to the latest Minitab tutorial. And what we're going to do today is we're going to use the fitted line plot. So we get effectively, we're going to generate a scatter diagram and we're going to add a regression equation. It's called the fitted line plot. Now, there are other ways of doing the scatter diagram. There is a scatter plot in Minitab, but it doesn't give you the equation, doesn't work out the R squared. So I'm going to show you the fitted line plot. This is my this is my choice uh, in terms of the way that I would generate a scatter plot and understand the relationship between an input and an output. So what we've got is here, look, the input and the output. Just to be clear, for those of you that are not mathematically minded, the input is always an X, the output is always the Y. What that means is, when Minitab draws the diagram, it will always put the input across the bottom scale. It'll put the output up the left-hand scale. And now you're going to see that in the software. When we go to the software, you will see it ask us for the X data and the Y data in the software. So let's go to Minitab and take a look at the fitted line plot. So here we are in Minitab. I've got some very simple data. Look, shoe size versus someone's height in inches. I'm just going to go up to the stat graph regression and the fitted line plot is the first one choose that it asks for the output height input shoe size then it starts asking for some other things what sort of graphs would you want i don't want to change that let's have a look at the options it asks me to do a title so it wouldn't be a bad thing to go shoe size versus height inches then click OK then I can just click OK and let's see what I get so you can see look it immediately gives me some information it gives me the equation there height equals 56.3 plus 1.5 shoe size it tells me the R squared is 90.73 which is excellent but if I scroll up all of that information is nicely contained pop that out nicely contained in the graph I've got the the title at the top which is great then I've got the equation just below it and then I've got the R squared 90.7 you can see the diagram with the fitted line line of best fit it's all there in a simple one-shot diagram so I don't really need to look at the session window and look at the data all the information I need is on the diagram there is the fitted line plot with an equation with R squared using Minitab. Okay, well I hope you enjoyed that little tutorial on that subject. If you've got any questions about Minitab that you want me to help you with, or indeed any questions about Six Sigma uh, at all, or indeed Lean, please drop me a message either in the comments below. Please subscribe also. Um, but you can also leave me an email. If you send me an email on any question and you need a little bit of advice, I'm more than happy to help you out. And of course, if you want me to come and help you inside your factory fix a technical problem, please drop me a line. I hope to hear from you soon.